So this customer uh, actually called us back after we did this job, but that's not where the story starts. If you need help keeping up with customers, sending estimates, invoices, and collecting payments all for free, check out Quote IQ. It'll be linked in the comment section and the description as well. First and foremost, we did a bunch of stuff on this house, right? We washed the roof, we washed the house, we washed the concrete driveway. We also washed um, some stone in the back as well. And uh, once we completed this job, uh, we left the property. I texted the homeowner to inform her that we had completed the job. I sent her some before and after pics so that way she can get a good idea of how good everything turned out. And at first she was super happy, but then she texted me a little while later when she got home and was able to take a look at everything and was wondering why some things weren't clean. And the things that she was asking me about did not match what we actually quoted her. So I went ahead and sent her over a picture of the quote um, just to kind of inform her that the things that she was asking me about were not included in the quote. And then after I sent that over it kind of cleared everything up uh, she was like oh okay you know we are happy with how everything came out um, I guess she was just hoping that maybe we would do a little bit more uh, but you guys know that we're only gonna clean what we quote we're not gonna go out of our way to clean extra things so if she wanted us to come back we would certainly come back and then we would upcharge her for what she wanted done uh, but anyway that's kind of where the the friction started a little bit was a misunderstanding between what it was that we quoted and what it was that we actually did on the job so I got that squared away but a few days later she actually gave me a call because she was concerned about some uh, white streaks on her gutters. I told her that that was pretty normal. It was from our cleaning solution washing down uh, off the roof and I told her that we would come out and just uh, give the gutters a rinse, right? Because we obviously didn't rinse them good enough whenever we were washing the house or we wouldn't really have any white streaks on them. So we did go back out to the house. We rinsed the gutters. We made sure that she was completely happy, happy with that. And the big message of today's video is going to be like when you're charging high prices, when you're charging premiums, when you're doing big jobs, because we did, we charged a good bit for this job. You also need to be prepared on the other side of that to make sure that the customer is 100% happy. 